Hi everyone, this is Ryan and today's topic I'm going to be talking about the two things you can do to become a successful trader. All right. So the first thing you can do is to pick the right trades. All right. Now what do I mean by picking the right trades? So trading is all about waiting and being patient. Right? Trading is not about sitting down in front of your screen and immediately clicking on your buy or sell button or immediately clicking whatever you see right now trading is about waiting for the proper setup to come to you now we all trade a certain strategy right it, it could be a trend strategy a range strategy a moving average a stochastic uh whatever fibonacci anything right or elliott waves right what whatever strategy you are using right we always have to wait for the setup to come to us so this means we have to be patient right if the setup is not there we do not enter the trade, right? So that's what I meant by waiting for the right trades to come, all right? And if you're looking at, you know, I, I like to trade with the trend most of the time, right? Following the trend. So this means that if there is a setup and the trend is against, uh, you know, my direction or my direction is against a trend, I would prefer to skip the trade as well, to stay out of the trade, all right? So trading is all about being patient and being disciplined waiting for the right setup to come and the second thing that you can do to become a profitable trader or a successful trader is proper risk management right now proper risk management risk management is a very very important part of trading now let's assume that you're trading with a thousand dollar account right and you're trading one standard lot okay this means if your trade goes 100 pips against you you have basically lost your whole account, right? Because one standard lot, one pip is $10, right? $10. So if you lose 50 pips, that's half your account gone. If you lose 100 pips, your whole account is gone, right? So therefore, your risk is too high. What you want to do is be trading with a very small risk and risk a maximum of 2% maximum per trade right so this means that for a thousand dollar account you want to risk a maximum of twenty dollars only per trade right so if let's say you're trading with a 20 pip stop loss that means you're going to be trading one mini lot where one pip is one dollar so if you lose 20 pips that's twenty dollars and that's a two percent loss per trade all right so that's uh that's uh what risk management is all about all right so today's topic right two things you can do to become a successful trader the first one picking the right trades and the second one proper risk management all right so i hope you gained some knowledge from today's video right if you did you know please like my facebook page or or, or subscribe to my youtube channel all right and i'll see you in the next video bye bye